So, hi. Hi, Marion. Hi, Frederic. How are you? Fine. Fine. We're both French, but we're speaking in English. Yes, it's a pleasure to be at Le Web and a pleasure to, to be with uh, French Web. Yes, absolutely, because uh, uh, just in a word, you were, um, just before we, are, we discuss about all the, uh, your responsibilities uh, into AXA Group, um, you were actually a contributor for French Web, for yes. our magazine. And um, you were in, uh, based in the Silicon Valley uh, for about three years and a half. Yes. And was it great? I, I suppose so. It, it was, was, it was fantastic. You. I think it's a, it's a dream to be in Silicon Valley. I think that you really feel uh, the future. I think it's, a, it's amazing. Um, for example, the first day uh, uh, at San Francisco, I had to, uh, to buy a, a mobile, you know, and uh, when I, I went to, to meet with AT&T, uh, the sales guy told me, oh, you know, um, in San Francisco, there are earthquakes, so you feel a bit uh, scary. And he told me, do you want to geolocalize your kids? And of course, you know, you have three kids, so the first thing I said, yes, yes, of course. So he sold me an application to geolocalize my, my kids on, on my smartphone. So I think that you feel the future because uh, um, I didn't think about geolocalizing my kids on a smartphone before uh, coming to Silicon Valley. So. When we began uh, in the Silicon Valley, it was for uh, BNP Paribas, yes. which is a, um, a French uh, bank company. Um, what was exactly your, your role? Were you an insider for BNP Paribas, for instance? In fact, I, I was uh, running the innovation lab of uh, BNP Paribas. So uh, uh, we were helping um, BNP Paribas and their subsidiaries to define their medium-term strategy concerning uh, the internet and mobile. But we did that also for other companies, uh, such as L'Oréal, such as uh, Chanel, uh, PPR, or the French uh, Yellow Pages, for example. So it was great to see very different uh, kind of uh, companies, companies just entering in the e-commerce uh, and companies such as uh, Pajun really facing the internet revolution, moving from paper to uh, internet and internet to mobile. So you know very well the, the startups ecosystem in the, in the valley. Yes. And you, you are actually now uh, the chief uh, marketing and distribution for AXA Group. Yes. Uh, for about um, ten, ten, months. 10 months. Yes, brand about new. A year. Um, why did you did you accept to um, to be in charge of digital disruption in a, in an insurance company? I'm a strong believer of traditional companies. I think that uh, the future belongs to uh, traditional companies that have the ability to embrace uh, digital. And I think that uh, AXA is a, a global leader. Is we are present in uh, 57 conference? countries. Uh, we have uh, 106 okay. million customers. <laughs> cool. And I think that uh, it's a huge company huge opportunity to really uh, push uh, digital. We are uh, already a global leader, the first brand of insurance. We are a uh, leader in nine countries concerning uh, the internet, and it's, uh, there is a huge opportunity to really uh, embrace uh, digital for AXA. Um, what is exactly your mission? Because uh, I know the budget, uh, you know, the, the, uh, this budget you, you, you're in charge of and you can spend uh, like you want. Um, How much is it? And what is exactly your principle, your main mission? So at, at the moment, uh, I'm uh, chief marketing and, and distribution officer. So um, I'm really uh, uh, trying to, to move uh, AXA to embrace digital. For example, uh, for distribution, you know, we have uh, uh, a lot of uh, agents and uh, advisors uh, at a global level. And we want them to, uh, to use more digital. So for example, we... Um, We signed an agreement with IRC Social, a startup that you discovered uh, yesterday with, uh, with Clara Shee, and it allows advisors to use uh, social networks such as LinkedIn, such as uh, Facebook or Twitter. And um, with, this, uh, with this app, we, we had 17% more business in the US, for example, so it's a huge opportunity. So uh, my role is really to contribute to uh, transform the company uh, concerning digital. It's the same for advertising, for example. We launched recently uh, an app uh, because for me it's really important what we call second screen uh, to make the bridge between a TV and mobile. And we launched this app uh, through uh, Shazam and we had uh, 150 uh, downloads of Shazam and uh, concerning the app, three, 300,000 downloads in only uh, two weeks. So I think it was a, a huge success. And we see that uh, a company such as AXA can be in the uh, top five uh, of the App Store. And uh, I was really proud because I have three kids and I told them we are just after Candy Crush. Wow, so, congrats. Uh, <laughs> we, we can do it. So it means that an insurance company uh, can uh, develop yes. its own application. Was it developed inside the company, or oh, did you? We, 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 we partnered with some uh, startups because I think it's it's great to uh, to do that. Mm. Um, 
you, you, I mean, uh, my question, my the first question was, how much, uh, how, what, what is the budget exactly? So you, Yes, yeah, so, so for example, for digital, we have a budget of 600 uh, million euros. So it's, uh, I'm very lucky. Uh, That's huge. And we are very lucky uh, because uh, we, we want really to focus uh, on digital. Uh, it's, it's a huge priority for us. And we are recruiting a lot. We are recruiting 150 people uh, on, on digital, so at a global level and in our 57 countries. And it's key for us. Um, Concerning the, 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 the mission you, you, you have inside the, the, this insurance company, uh, is your role to, you know, um, feel the, the, the new startups that develop, for instance, uh, financial services in the Silicon Valley? So we, we have a, a fund in, in, uh, in France called uh, Axacid. So uh, it's key for us to, uh, to fund uh, startups in, uh, in, in France, for example. We, I, I just uh, opened uh, an innovation lab in uh, San Francisco uh, because it's also key to, uh, to have a bridge between uh, Silicon Valley and, and, and Paris and Europe. It's an uh, incubator, actually. Uh, it, it's, it's a lab, so okay. many, we, we have uh, four missions. The first one is really to, uh, to train uh, because I think that uh, we have uh, 160,000 employees employees and it's really key to train them to uh, digital. I think it's, it's really key. Uh, we can recruit experts but uh, I think that we will be successful if we cross-sell our expertise with the expertise of uh, digital experts. So first mission uh, training. Second mission is really to partner with big companies uh, in Silicon Valley, so Google, Apple, uh, all the, the big players. Third mission is really to scout startups, uh, new trends uh, that are key for us. For example, uh, recently uh, I, met, I met a startup that developed an app uh, to connect your car with your mobile. So we see that, uh, that the revolution is coming in our, in our sector. You have, uh, the, for example, the Google car, uh, a car without a driver for an insurance company. It's a, yeah. it's a huge challenge. And, uh, and the fourth mission is really to do some pilots locally with our uh, American uh, subsidiary in the US or in Mexico. We are number two in Mexico, so we have a, uh, a great position. And it's uh, great also to do some, uh, some partners to try some uh, new tools, uh, new devices from uh, startups. Uh, when, you talk, when we talk about uh, the disruption, the mm -hmm. transfers, transformation of main companies, uh, it means actually that all the team uh, needs to be involved in the project. How do you work to involve all the team, all the, I mean, all your collaborators to engage in digital disruption? So training is key. So uh, we, we are training uh, the, the main um, executives of AXA uh, concerning uh, digital and internet and mobile. We will also develop some uh, what we call uh, corporate open um, innovation uh, courses, so uh, the equivalent of MOOC, uh, but for, for companies. Talk about Cook now. Yes, Cook, Have you ever exactly. heard about that? Yes, yes, yes. The corporate uh, online courses. It's exactly, exactly. So, is it a reality in, in AXA? We, we, we are developing such a, such a tool. I think it's, it's, really, it's really key for us. To really train uh, train people, I think that uh, that uh, everybody will uh, will do digital. You know, in our call center, uh, more and more through uh, uh, chat, through uh, social media. So we have we have to train everybody. It's really key for us. Is it expensive to develop such a, such a thing like a cook or a mook inside? It, it's it's a necessity. Uh, I think that it's a different way of, uh, of using its uh, training budget. It's not that expensive. When we prepare this this pa this panel together, you you, you told me that. Uh, what is important in, is to not to be disconnected with the, um, the, the physical, you know, uh, system, the physical um, AXA re retail points. Mm -hmm. how, can, you, can you just uh, um, explain in how you, uh, you involve this, uh, all the, the uh, you know, the, the key points of AXA Group? So, um, you know that 70% uh, of our consumers are um, beginning their internet journey when they are looking for insurance product over the net or over the mobile. For example, 17% uh, of the searches uh, from Google concerning the uh, insurance keyword are coming from mobile. So it's a, it's a huge revolution for us. And in some markets, for example, in the UK, already 75% of the market is already digital. So we know that uh, one day we'll become uh, fully digital. But uh, uh, we know that... Uh, a lot of consumers will, uh, will send their contract uh, at a point of sale, a physical point of sale, because um, when you are looking for protection, uh, advice is key. 
And maybe some products will be uh, fully commoditized, uh, but uh, a lot of products will, for example, health concerning retirement, you need advice and, uh, and you need to, to meet somebody. Uh, and it, it's key today and it will be key uh, for the future also. Uh, what kind of, uh, we, we talked about, uh, for obviously, uh, financial services, mm -hmm. but you, you, your focus on other, you know, um, other trends, yes. like healthcare, which is very important for an insurance company, I suppose. Yes, so our calling is really to protect people, so it's, uh, it's very important for us to understand these uh, new trends. For example, you know what we call a wearable device, it's uh, really key for us. Uh, you have a job on. Yes, yes, okay. and, uh, and uh, we, in France we have a fantastic company also, such as uh, White Things, for example. Uh, and connected objects will be uh, really key. Uh, especially for health, it's, uh, it's very important uh, for us. We, we developed uh, an app, for example, recently, Axa Drive, to help consumers to better drive their car, and prevention is really key. And now you have a lot of great apps that we are developing to help uh, consumers to, uh, to really um, uh, optimize their, their, their behavior concerning driving, concerning health, and it's, uh, it's very important for us. So uh, connected objects on a wearable device, it's, uh, it's really, uh, really important. So, I mean, I understand that you, you, you want to develop uh, applications, yes. B2C, why not, applications, yes. but how can you, um, what, what about the challenge of the data, for instance, how can you use all the data you, you can, you know, receive? For us, it's really uh, important to use uh, big data. Uh, at the moment, we are an insurance company using big data. Uh, in the future, we'll be a, a big data company uh, protecting people. So it's a, it's, a, it's a revolution for us, big data. I think that uh, the key point for us is trust. Uh, Robert Scoble said uh, trust is the new currency. I think it's really, uh, really that. Uh, it's really important. Many, many companies will be able to uh, provide big data, uh, but only a few will get the trust of the consumers. Uh, at Taxa, we have 106 million uh, Consumers, so it's uh, it's really key for us to, to keep them to, to keep them loyal and to make sure that uh, uh, we respect their data privacy. So it's a really an important point for us to uh, to get the trust of our uh, customers. And regarding the trends, what is the, the trend you you're looking for? You you know you focus particularly. I think second screen, second screen is, is really a, a strong trend. Uh, how to make the, the bridge between uh, traditional media and uh, digital media. This is why, for example, in our last ad, we, we used the Shazam to make the bridge. Um, I, there are many, many startups. For example, you have Quarter in, in the US uh, from Carlos Diaz, uh, uh, really uh, pushing this trend of connecting the, uh, the traditional media with, with, with new media. I think for, for the advertiser, it's really, uh, it's really a challenge. And there are, there are huge opportunities. Uh, for example, uh, we, we launched a, 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 a last commercial uh, this month, and 15% uh, of our contacts came from uh, Facebook mobile, for example. So it's, it's really key uh, to, to use uh, the full ecosystem, and, and mobile will be uh, more and more important, especially uh, concerning uh, what we call solo-mo, uh, social uh, um, media, local content, and, and mobile. We see this convergence more and more uh, important for, for insurance companies, and it's a huge opportunity for, for a group such as AXA. Do you believe in gamification? Yes, gamification. Uh, for example, we, we, our app Axa Drive uses gamification. You have a score and you can compare this score with, uh, with your friends on social media. It's a perfect way to really uh, uh, drive behavior to, uh, to, to better protect uh, people. And, uh, and I think that gamification is key, especially for Gen Y. Uh, we, we had the opportunity uh, to have uh, 50 uh, students coming uh, uh, in, in September to meet with our management committee and really to, to spend time to listen to, to Gen Y. This new generation is very important to, to understand uh, uh, what they want, their needs uh, as consumers, but also uh, as, uh, as, as future manager. I think it's, uh, it's key for us to, to attract uh, these people. Uh, recruitment will be key. This is why we are recruiting 150 uh, people on digital, and it's uh, key for us. The next 10 years, to conclude, uh, can you tell us, Frederick, three, two or three main challenges for you in, uh, inside AXA Group? I think that if, uh, if we are successful in uh, using our uh, traditional expertise and uh, our know-how, uh, the trust of a customer, with uh, the new trends from uh, digital, from big data, I think AXA will be very, very successful. And I think that uh, big data is, is really key. 
uh, quantified self is also key, and really uh, second screen on, on mobile. There are really three uh, three trends, very strong and very important for for AXA. Uh, AXA is already a, a global leader, and I'm sure within 10 years will still be a, a global leader. This is why I joined AXA recently. Super. Thank you so much, Frederic. Thank, Thank you, Mario. You.